top 7 richest presidents in Africa. In Africa, a continent rich with natural resources, many see politics as a way for leaders to enrich themselves. In this video, we look at the top 7 richest presidents in Africa. At number 7, we have Paul Bia. The president of Cameroon has a net worth estimated at 200 million and is the 7th richest African president. Bia has led Cameroon since 1982 and is known for his extravagant lifestyle. He also owns various properties and businesses worldwide. At number 6 is King Muswati III of Eswatini. King Muswati has an estimated net worth of 210 million US dollars. King Muswati's wealth is inherited from his forefathers. At number 5, we have Cyril Ramaphosa. The president of South Africa has amassed a fortune of 450 million US dollars. Before entering politics, he was a businessman and activist and took over the presidency from Jacob Zuma in 2017. Ramaphosa also served as the head of South Africa's National Planning Commission. At number 4, we have William Ruto of Kenya. The president of Kenya ranks as number 4 with an estimated net worth of 500 million US dollars. Before being elected president in 2022, Ruto served as deputy president to Uhuru Kenyatta from 2013 to 2022. He was also minister and member of parliament prior to being elected deputy president. At number 3, we have Paul Kagame of Rwanda. The president of Rwanda ranks third with a net worth of 600 million US dollars. He became president in 2000 and has been a pivotal figure in Rwandan politics, noted for his role in ending the Rwandan genocide in 1994. At number 2, we have Theodoro Obiang Nguema of Equatorial Guinea. He has an estimated net worth of 700 million US dollars. He has been in power since a 1979 military coup that deposed his uncle. A portion of his wealth is believed to come from exploiting his nation's oil resources and despite the nation's poverty, his personal wealth includes lavish properties and expensive cars. Muhammad VI of Morocco, 
tops the list with a net worth of $5 billion. He ascended to the throne in 1999 following his father's death and has pursued efforts to address poverty and corruption in Morocco, leveraging his extensive education and royal lineage to bolster his governance. That is it. See you in the next video.